Welcome in, Chad Hibden, women's basketball coach here at Trevec. And as I said a minute ago, all things considered, you got to be pretty happy with some of the things that you saw out there tonight for the Treasure. Much improvement over the lane game. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, you know, some of the things we're trying to do uh, with the group that we have, uh, we're more familiar with, comfortable with. Uh, effort still got to, we got we to pick that energy up. And, 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 and these young ladies know that and they know for us to compete. Uh, we really can't have any effort breakdowns. And, and, and you know, we did okay, you know, pretty good, but, but there's still some, some, some opportunities. And, and we're playing five and five. And mm -hmm. so there are no you know, really excuses or, or, or scenarios where they're exhausted from exertion. So we got to clean that up. And, and, and these young women are trying to figure that out. And a uh, uh, good opportunity for us to get better. And, and, and there are some things that, that we did today and we're doing that, we're, that we didn't expect we would have to do that will help us be better on, uh, later on. Absolutely. I thought some of the things in the half court set in particular, you guys got some shots you want. Not everything went, but then some of it started going. And some of that's confidence in it because these are some girls that didn't expect to be even – you got two that weren't even on the varsity roster at the start of the year. Correct, yeah. And, you know, playing half the game right now. Yeah. So, and that's good. And, and they both did some nice things. And the ball's going to go in the basket, and that's just getting out there. And uh, But it's got to start happening quick you know, yeah. for them. Sammy Whiteman doesn't look like a freshman anymore. No, she, she's been in the battle enough that uh, she's still learning, yeah, obviously. Yeah, abs uh, absolutely. But, but it's not overwhelming. Uh, yeah. But now Wednesday will be a different story because they're <laughs> going to get after us. Uh, and her and Sophie and the rest of those guards are going to have to really, really – uh, handle the pressure and mm -hmm. the traps and things like that. And so we'll we'll have to be ready for that because it will be a different atmosphere and a different environment. On the road against a team that's going to really try to get after us. Absolutely. It's Coach Chab Hidden. We'll be back with uh, the broadcast. We won't have the broadcast. Kentucky Western will have it on Wednesday night in Owensboro. So you can watch that. We'll have the link at TNUTrojans.com. And then it's Christmas break. You guys get a chance to heal up and get everybody back, hopefully, or uh, several of the guys, uh, girls back yeah. on the roster too. That's what we're hoping, what we're praying for. That's a Christmas wish to, you know, have those healthy bodies. And, and, and then once we get them back, then it's going to take some time. So, mm -hmm. we're, you know, we're hoping mid-January that, uh, you know, after those first couple of conference games, uh, you know, we can get back and then, and then make a run uh, and, and, and build some excitement and build some uh, small successes along the way and uh, hopefully finish strong. Absolutely. Well, Merry Christmas, Merry Christmas to you and you yours. Guys. And we'll see you guys in the new year right here on the Trojan Sports Network.